Hello everyone and welcome to another horror Poppy Graybeard horror game. Poppy Graybeard horror game, not horror puppy whatever. Anyways, this game is called Peter's House. It is a horror game from itch.io. If you want to know more about it, the link will be down in the description below if you want to check it out and play it. Um, but before we get into this game, make sure you like, subscribe, share, and hit the little bell. That way you know when my videos go live for you. Check, you could uh, join me at youtube.com slash poppygraybeard and check out all my other horror game videos and everything else that I do. Uh, if you want to watch my other channel, it's youtube.com slash at poppygraybeardretro where I play horror, uh, retro games. I'm losing it. I'm losing it. And if you want to watch me live, watch me live on Twitch at twitch.tv slash poppygraybeard. Now, also, I am on Kick at kick.com uh, slash poppygraybeard. Without further ado, let's jump right in. Peter's house. Steve, the phone rings. Ring, 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 ring. Ring, 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 ring. Hello, this is Steve from Al Able, Able Movers. How can I help you? <coughs> this is Peter. Hi, Steve, this is Peter. I need help with moving some boxes tonight. Weird. Steve. Sure, we can definitely help you with that. Can you give me a bit more information about the job? Peter. Yeah, I have a few boxes that I need to move on my new house. I'll be out tonight, so the door will be unlocked. Steve. Okay, I'll come over tonight and take care of it. Can you give me your address? Peter. Sure, my address is 619 Main Street. Steve. Great. I'll take care of everything. Is there anything else you need from us? Peter. No, that's all. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Steve. Steve. You're welcome. Peter. Have a good night. Peter. You're true. Thanks again. That was horrible. Well, time to move some boxes. Um, left my mouse button interact. Right mouse button release. Ooh, okay, it moves pretty smooth, okay, all right, okay, so, got one, this one says that it must go to the bedroom, okay, a lot of, door, a lot of doors, bathroom, there's a toilet in there, I'm guessing this is the kitchen, The bathroom. We're missing a lot of uh, things that make a house a home. What is? Okay, do I put it here? This is not the right place. Okay. I thought it was a bedroom. I saw a TV on the floor. Baby's room. That's why it's making that much sound. Oh, the TV turned on. Okay, cool. Ding dong, ding dong, ding dong. Okay. What is this? Oh, that's to go outside. Why is it? Even? Okay, so it's this way. Okay. Okay, here we go. Got to keep box the gotta keep moving boxes. Okay, kitchen. The kitchen is over here, cause I know, cause there's a fridge in here. Okay, it's like I want to eat, but I can't. So I gotta hear all this shit. Okay, another one in the kitchen. That's cool. So this guy put all the boxes in front of the house, right? And it blows my mind because as he brought them in, he could have just put them where they go. You know, obviously they're marked. But hey, I ain't judging. This one doesn't say where to place it. Should I open it? You know what? Let's open it. Oh! <gasps> Is that blood on the knife? It is blood. What is this? The Betrayal of a Friend, Part 1. 
I never should have told my best friend about my wife. Cause she was probably fine as fuck, you know? Fine as hell. It was a moment of carelessness, a slip of the tongue. But what did it matter? He was just another person in my life who didn't understand me, who couldn't comprehend the power that I held. When he asked where she was, I casually replied that she was buried. He laughed it off, not realizing that I was dead serious. Nice choice of words. But I knew I couldn't take any chances. All right. Oh, there's more. I excused myself to go to the bathroom, but instead I went to the kitchen and found a sharp knife. It was easy enough to sneak up behind him and plunge it into his back. He let out a pathetic gasp before crumbling, crumpling to the floor. I felt nothing as I watched him bleed out. He was just another obstacle that I had to remove. Another person who didn't, didn't belong in my world. Interesting. Alright, well. Just put this right here. Yeah. Let's see what this one is. This one says the baby's room. I hear somebody walking. Hello? Okay, baby's room is over here, right? How can I turn this off? Like that. Okay, should I put it on the counter, but I put it on the, on the floor. All right, I was hearing steps. It says living room. Is this the living room? Or is this the living room? Here we go. Yeah. We're doing good. We're doing good. Dining room. Okay. Drop it right there because if you try to put it on a table, it goes on, it goes on the floor anyways. Okay. We're almost done. Bedroom. Bedroom. A lot of crosses. A lot of crosses. Okay. Uh, bathroom. There you go. We're doing it! Proud of myself. I wonder how much I'm getting paid. This one says it must go in the baby's bedroom. Interesting. It must go. Okay. Let's see what else. And I heard footsteps. That's the creepy part. Okay. This one says it must go in the kitchen. Did they all see that? Oh, did I just pick up on that right now? Sure, I did. I just picked up on it. Kitchen. I know somebody named Kitchen. That's the real last name. This one doesn't say where to place. Maybe I should open it. Let's open it, baby. Oh, there's a journal inside and wedding rings. The end of a marriage. I couldn't believe it when she threatened to leave me. After all I've done for her, she had the audacity to suggest that we separate because of a silly little dog. It's not like <laughs> I have a silly little dog, but anyway, that's all the story. It's not like I didn't, I did anything that bad. Sure, I killed it, but it was barking too loudly and it was starting to piss me off. And it's not like I haven't killed small animals before. Pigeons, rats, what's the difference? But she couldn't handle it this time. She caught me in the act, holding dog's ear by, in my hand like some sort of trophy. That's when she threatened to divorce me. That was early this year, look. I couldn't let her leave me. I had to make her understand that I was in control. Now, whenever I look at that ring, I'm reminded of how powerful I am. You know what I'm saying? All right, so we're gonna put this. No, we're gonna put this over here. Why did the TV turn on by itself? That's a strange part. Okay, leave that right there. Carry on, carry on. All right, you need four more bucks. The lights are freaking, but there's no lights. You know what I'm saying? Okay, 
We're good. We're good. All right. This one says the bathroom. Okay. This one says it must go in the living room. Right there. We're almost done. Two more. This one says it must go in the dining room. Dining room. All that work made me thirsty. I should go eat something to drink before I leave. But then I got one more box. Okay, that one doesn't say where the place is. So we're gonna go drink we're gonna go drink something first because I'm thirsty. Oh, oh, what do I feel like there's something going on here? Hmm, I bet he wouldn't mind if I take some of this juice. Time to go. Okay. Can we just walk in? Oh. What was that sound? Doors are closed. Oh. Wow, there's a package right there. How about this one? I didn't get to open this one. Okay, here we go. Here you go. Glasses. There's a journal inside some glasses. Oh, this is the Snoop. Part one, like Snoop Dogg. I was sure I had covered my tracks, but her sisters were getting suspicious. One of them came to speak to me in person, sensing that something was not right. She kept prying and asking too many questions, so I had to take action. I couldn't risk her snooping around, so I had to act fast. I tried to convince her that my wife was away on a trip and wouldn't be back anytime soon, but she wasn't buying it. She started getting too close. I could smell her. Asking too many questions. In a moment of frustration, I grabbed a heavy object and struck her over the head. <clears throat> like that. She, her glasses flew off her head. She crump, crumpled to the ground, groaning in pain. She lay there, gasping for air, grasping at her throat. I could feel her struggling beneath me as I squeezed the life out of her. It was a small victory. I felt that. I felt that. That was intense. Okay, I'm going to leave that right here. Okay. Is that it? Okay, there's one more that somebody dropped off. Of, uh, what is this? Oh, should I open it? Okay, could I, should I go in here and open it? I'm going to go over here just in case something happens. I could, um, I got the table to... You know, run around, you know. All right, ready? <clears throat> Is this real? That's a face. All right, the vanishing act, part one, February 19, 2023. It was only a matter of time before someone realized that my wife and her sister were missing. My wife, my wife's other sister, the one I had spared, had grown suspicious and went to the police. I knew I had to act fast. I packed my bags and left town, but I knew that it wasn't enough. The detectives would come looking for me, asking questions that I couldn't answer. So I came up with a plan. I knew that I couldn't just disappear and hope for the best. I had to make it seem like I too was a victim that I had vanished alongside my wife and her sister. It was a risky move, but I was confident that it would work. I began by staging a break-in at our home. I smashed the window and ransacked the place, <clears throat> making it look like someone had broken in and taken all us all. I had left a few items of clothing behind along with other, with some other personal touches to make it seem more convincing. Then I disappeared. No, hold on, hold on. Then, um, uh, where is it? Then I disappeared like magic. However, to ensure that no one gets too close to me, I started learning about the spike drinks with drugs. Although I did not condone this behavior, it made me feel powerful. Oh, he's strong now. All right, so. Doors open. Uh, 
That's not what I saw before. What's going on? Am I tripping? What is this? Oh. Don't scare me. Oh. Oh. Oh my god. The door closed behind me. Oh. Okay. Don't. Oh. Don't scare me. It's still going. Oh, third time's the charm. Oh, I can't see. Oh, fourth time. Okay, we're almost there. Oh, oh, we're at the end, and the phone's ringing. Ring, ring, ring. Okay, where's the phone? Do I gotta walk back? Okay, here we go. Ready? Oh, don't scare me. Oh, the hairs on my, my legs are standing up. I can feel it in my arms too. Whew. Okay. All right. All right. Oh, it's dark in there. Oh, I'm walking in. Shit, the lights are out. I hope my phone's battery didn't die. Come on, come on. There, I can at least see where I'm heading now. Oh. Oh, it's so dark in here! Why does it sound like it's ringing from over here? Okay. Oh! Where's the phone? Why is that on the wall? Oh my god, all the cars are upside down. Where's the phone? Anybody out there? Okay. Oh! Hello? Oh my god! It's over here. Oh, oh, what was that? There was something right there looking at me. He was like, I saw him. Okay. Oh, are you in here, sir? Bloom, it was like a bald head. I want to open it. Okay. Okay. Phones are ringing. I hear it on the right, I hear it on the left. Oh my god, it's in here! Where's the blue man? Is it in the ba There's a door in the baby's room. I wasn't there before. Oh my god, it's a baby. <gasps> the TV's on again. Oh! What's in there? Close it. Oh! Turn that shit off. Can't focus. Where's this phone ringing? Is it in here? Let's go for it. Oh my god! I'm scared. We're gonna make it. It's don't scare me. Oh my god! That was made for me to turn around. Okay. Oh my god! I am so tense. Okay. All right, it's getting louder. Here we go. Let's answer the phone. Oh. There it is! Look at this big, huge room. I'm gonna close this door. Ring, ring. Okay. Hello? What do you want from me? Your job was just to move the damn boxes, not to open them. Well, there he is. What's up, bro? He shot me. Wow. That was cool. Thanks for playing, it says. All right. Well, that was Peter's house. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like, share, subscribe, and hit that little bell. That way you know when my videos go live for you. If you want to check out my channel, my channel is youtube.com slash poppygraybeard. If you want to check out my other channel, is youtube.com slash at poppygraybeardretro. And if you want to watch me live, watch me live on Twitch at twitch.tv slash poppygraybeard. And also watch me on kick at kick.com slash poppygraybeard. Thank you so much for watching. If you're interested in this game, there's a link below on where to find it and play it in the description. 
Thank you so much for watching. Until the next one, peace. Thanks for watching, dudes. For our newest video, click here.